G'day guys, it's a wet day here and what better thing to do on a wet day than make a video about an amazing bit of software that's just come out called StreamYard. So as they say here, it's the easiest way to create engaging live streams and that sort of says it all. So I want to take you inside the platform, I'm using it, I love it, it's really simple and here we go. So once you um, sign up, the um, there's a free account, there's also a paid account, I've gone with a paid account because I love it that much but you can start off in the free one. There is a link below, by the way, um, in the description, which um, if you sign up through that, you'll actually go on to a little system they have where they basically help each other out. So if you help me by signing up through me, you get um, a credit on your account as well. Uh, anyway, so let's go. So what you do is you add a destination, profile, page, or group for Facebook, channel through YouTube, and here you can connect to anything that has a live feed. You can also go live on your website if you wish. So I've connected to my YouTube channel uh, just to demonstrate it and I want to create a broadcast here. Let's go create broadcast, give it a test, test, create broadcast and I'm going to enter the broadcast studio. So there is this one here. Now because I'm recording my screen, there I am, g'day. Um, the microphone, it won't pick it up through StreamYard because I'm using it through the recording screen software. So you just put your name here, whatever you put here is what appears. Um, and you can change the color of this, of course, and just go into Broadcast Studio. Now you notice that we're not live yet, okay? So the first thing with StreamYard you need to know is you've got to add yourself to the feed, okay? So you can add or remove yourself um, on the feed. Now to invite people to the feed, you just click on Invite. You can send this link to them, or you know, if you want to do it via Gmail, it's very similar to Zoom. They create the email for you, it makes it nice and easy, and there it is there. So you just send it off to whoever you, you want to do it to. Um, get rid of that. So I'll just run you through the features very, very quickly. Um, on the right-hand side here, if you are going live on Facebook or YouTube and comments show up, you can show those down there too, so everyone can see them, and they can see what the question is being asked. You can also... Um, have a private chat so if you've got six people here that you're interviewing or two or three whatever you can talk amongst yourselves here and they will all see it so you can make conversations without interrupting the flow of your presentation now in banners uh, a banner is just a bit of text really at the bottom of the screen so you can um, create those here just type it in whatever you want add banner and then click on it to show okay uh, we'll get rid of that one so that's banners. Now in the brand, you can add a logo. Now I'm finding that the logo, it's only 150 by 150. It's very, very small. So if you've got a logo like StreamYard, it works very, very well. For the client that I'm doing a bit of work with at the moment, it didn't work. It's just too small. So no problem. You just do what's called an overlay. Very, very simple. So here's the overlay that StreamYard uh, use in their presentations. So it's just a big image that's transparent. So I've created one for my client, there it is there, and I've got another one which I'm going to use depending on what the background colour is. So if the background's dark, or dark enough, that will look pretty reasonable. I'm just in, an, in um, our lounge here at home at the moment recording. Uh, my office is being renovated, so excuse all the pink. Okay, moving on. Now, that's brand, private chat we've done, banners, share screen. This bit here, you've got a few options here. Um, you can do your entire screen. You can do an application. So if you're doing a, um, say you're doing a presentation that's in pages or it's in, um, what's the one on Mac? I can never, ever remember the name of it. Doesn't matter. Whatever. It's like PowerPoint. Leave in the comments if you know what it is. I can never remember the name. Or you've got a Chrome tab. So if I, for instance, want to share a you know, website or a Google search or something like that, um, I'd come back to share and I would click on Chrome tab and I'd choose Google, share, come back here and once again to add anything you've got to click on it so I'd add that, there it is and I can be beside it that way or that way, a couple of options there, get rid of that, stop sharing or if I share, I'm going to find out what it's called, one moment, don't go away. It's called Keynote. I can't find it, so I'm just using um, pages in here. So um, if we want to record this one here, we'll come back to our screen, share screen, go to application window, and it would be this one here. Share. Once again, you've got to add it. There it is there. 
Okay, so if you want to do a presentation, um, you can do it like that. Right, or if I want to do a full presentation, just turn myself off. Okay, um, now the reason it can't hear me is that I'm recording with a screen software, a screen recording software, so um, it's blocking StreamYard from picking up the mic, so that's why it's getting a bit worried. So there's the brand colors there. If you want to change it to whatever you want, you can change it. And put myself back there. We'll stop sharing. And there's the color there. So whatever color you want, you can do there. Nice and easy. We've gone through that, gone through that. That's pretty much it, guys. Um, I'm really impressed with it. I like the simplicity of it. It's very, very simple. If you, if you want to go live, just click Go Live. And what I'm using it for is I go live on my channel, then I'll download the um, video, edit it, and upload it onto the customer's channel. So I find that pretty good. When um, I will do some Go Lives as well, and um, I can do it on behalf of my client as well. I can They can use this tool as well. So yeah, really, really good. I love it. There's a link below. Join it. You won't regret it. Bye.